this is the book of Matthew, chapter 24, verse 6, and it reads the whole scriptures. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that should be no trouble, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Matthew 24 and 7. For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, uh, Bukhar Kadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. And shalom to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well too. And I say shalom to you Akim out there. And this is a uh, sit down lesson, uh, a couple of news articles that I'm about to bring out. I brought them out earlier today when I was about to do them, but I was, you know, I was, I was like, uh, I might decide to do it a little bit later, but uh, I was able to uh, focus on now doing the uh, sit down lesson. So, you know, the title of this sit down lesson is going to be uh, Wars and Rumors of Wars, and I'm going to bring out a couple of news articles as well, too, and hopefully I can be able to find them and look them up and read them as well, too. And this first news article, uh, okay, this is the first one right here, and this is from the Wall Street Journal, and this was uh, published uh, by Marcus Walker, April 19th, 2023, at 9.27 a.m. Eastern Time, from the Wall Street Journal, and it reads, Russia drones target Austria. Ostasa, if I pronounced that right, as Ukraine seeks more air defense. And keep this in mind, I believe uh, the United States, they announced more 326 million in military aid assistance. And then they recently had the uh, Patriot missile defense uh, uh, just was recently being deployed over there in Ukraine. I forgot what area it was. So, you know, that's just a prime example right there of the Russian-Ukraine situation is, you know, the attentions are just going to continue to escalate more and more and more. And read this again. It says the Russian target. Right. I know a lot of stuff saying we're $50 a snack. Yeah. I'm going to sit down at the thing. Yeah, right. That's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Yeah. Because I knew it was going to be Right. <laughs> Like yeah, I think they said it was going to uh, storm around about four or five o'clock. Yeah. Uh, Salakia for that I was talking to my OG, but um, yeah, back to what I was saying. That uh, I'm gonna read this again for edification's sake. It says Russian drone target Odessa as Ukraine seeks more air defense. The U.S. And, and European allies to discuss further military aid ahead of Kyiv's planned push to retake territory. It says the Russian drone hits infrastructure in the southern Ukraine part of the city of Odessa overnight as battles for control of the Ukraine skies continues. It says uh, Ukraine's air force said it shot down 10 out of 12 Iranian-made shared drones fired at Odessa's by Russian forces. Public infrastructure was hit by Odessa's district military administration said without pacifying there were no report of casualties. And this is a uh, second news article that I want to bring out as well too. You know while you have the current tensions are stirring up between uh, the United States and China over Taiwan. And this article was published by Navdeep, Navdeep uh, Yadev as 12 hours ago, if I pronounced that name right. 
and this is from msn.com and this is from ben zergara if i pronounced that right and it says u.s sends over 200 military instructors to train taiwan army a man rising threat from Xi, Xi Jinping, a president of uh, China. And it reads, amending rising threat from Xi Jinping, China's, the U.S. on Tuesday sent nearly 200 active duty military instructors to train military personnel in Taiwan. It says, what happened? Taiwan's Ministry of National Defense MND on Tuesday said it welcomes Washington's effort to help the country's train its troops. Reportedly, I mean, reported Taiwan's semi official central news agency. The official comedy came after a source told CNA on Monday that around 200 U.S. military instructors are currently stationed at base across Taiwan. It says the trainers are deployed at boot camps and reserve bridge to monitor Taiwan procedures and offer practical advice on training techniques. The source says Taiwan will use the military's advice guidance in the future to enhance its training programs, particularly when the required military service duration is increased from four months to one year in 2024. Why it matters? It says the most is likely to fuel the China U.S. tensions further as Beijing has repeatedly asked Washington not to play with fire. It says the U.S., like most countries, doesn't have more diplomatic relations with Taiwan due to its disputes status, but President Joe Biden has often reiterated that he would intervene militarily to defend Taiwan from China attack. And I believe it's a third news article as well, too, if I can find it. So, you know, that's just a prime example of the increasing of the uh, wars and rumors of wars, you know. Let's see if I can be able to find the last uh, news article. Yeah, I think that was, yeah, I think that was the last article. Yeah, I believe that was the last news article. Yep, that was the last news article. Well, since I wasn't able to uh, look for the third news article, so it was two news articles as I, as I read in the, as I read and I read it back up with the scriptures as well too. So yeah, I'm gonna read uh, Matthew's 24 and 6 once again. So you know we're definitely seeing the uh, rise and increase of these nations and different kingdoms going against one another. While you have the Russian-Ukraine situation uh, continually to increase, and you have the uh, what's going on over there in the South China Sea, right along the Taiwan Strait, as the tensions between uh, China and the United States over Taiwan is continuing to increase and build up now more than ever. And this is uh, Matthew 24 and 6, and I'm going to bring it out again through the Holy Scriptures, and it reads from BibleGateway.com, KJV version of the Holy Scriptures. Matthew 24 and 6 and it reads and ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars see that ye be not troubled for all these things must come to pass but the end is not yet right because it's going to continue to increase more and more and more of the wars and rumors of wars between the different nations you know uh, one nation going against another nation definitely uh, from a military perspective you know so with that hopefully this uh, sit down lesson was edifying and I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Bukhar Kadash. Uh, double honors to the elders for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well, too. 
And until next time, I will say Shalom.